Hey there beautiful people, in today's video I want to show you how to do a DIY gallery wall using Dollar Tree frames, so let's get it. Alright, so you're going to need a few things, you're going to need paper, pictures, frame, and of course tape. So you are more than welcome to do this however you want, but in my case I'm going to make it as simple as possible. So you can use white paper, but in my case, I'm just going to use the back of the paper that came with the frame already. I'm just going to flip it on the other side and utilize that. But if you want extra, I guess, security or you don't want the picture that's on the back of it to show through the frame, then use extra paper just for extra security. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to line the picture up perfectly so that way all the white parts around the picture equal. I got these pictures printed out at Walmart. I printed out the five by sevens in black and white because the frames are eight by tens. I wanted it shorter than the frame so that way the white part, you know, stuck out as well as the picture. So yeah, these are five by sevens and the frames are eight by tens. So I put tape on the pictures and then I line up the picture perfectly amongst the white part so that way the square or the white part outside of the picture is perfect. Then I flip it over and then I close the frame and that's pretty much it. Like I say, if you just want the white part to be thicker or solid, then add extra paper, but you don't have to, it's totally up to you. So once again, I'm gonna do it again, and that's it. So right now, because I only have four frames, I only used four frames to start the gallery wall. I think I'm going to add more to the wall. I don't know how my wall will look, with a lot of pictures on it. But the purpose of me doing this is because I like pictures with that white trim around. I just love it. Like I love canvases, which I plan on doing sometime later on. You know as I get more pictures but I just love that white trim that white frame around the pictures that's what I was aiming for to have like that white background around it and I just love it I just love it so yeah all you need is some Dollar Tree frames for a dollar the pictures only cost like five dollars as I printed out a few and that's pretty much it you guys so simple so easy and you're more than welcome to use however many you want okay and it just looks so classy it looks so I don't know it just looks more elegant I don't know what it is I just love this style of pictures So once I'm done getting the frames in order, it's time to hang them up. Tried to hang them up as best as I could without measuring, but your girl had to go back and do some remeasuring because I don't know if my OCD kicked in or something. I don't know. I just don't like it uneven or whatever. But for the sake of this video, I put it up so you guys can see how it looked. So I just, I just love how these pictures look on this wall. I don't know, you guys. Give me some suggestions. Do you think I should add some more? pictures to the gallery wall or should I just leave it like that because y'all know I like things minimal I don't like a lot of extra stuff going on but I don't know I feel like I could add to this collection so if you think I should let me know down below So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I hope this was simple and easy and something that you think will work for your house. Let me know any suggestions or let me know if you plan on doing this and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Peace.